Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to share with you guys how I do my rosettes and embellish them. So I grab a 12 inch uh, piece of crepe paper and I cut it in half so I can make two. And right now I'm just uh, doing the accordion fold and I'm going to glue the ends. So just add glue to that side and then connect it to the other side. And then with the palm of my hand I just press on it so it could form with my circle punch uh, I believe it's a one inch um, I just put it in the center and do that on the other side too and I like my my rosettes to look pretty round so I'm just trimming a little bit so they look pretty so let's start embellishing them um, right here I have a tray of all the scraps of paper I have left over and um, that's all I'm pretty much going to use. That little floral cutout is from a 12 by 12 paper. I just cut it. Just added sequins and a cute little banner. So many ideas you can do with these. And a little cute little butterfly. Some floral sequins from Hobby Lobby. And that's how it looks. Now for the blue one, I'm gonna add a, a pink banner in the center. And then I'm gonna layer this heart and this was a, a leftover from a, a shaker paper clip shaker I made and I already had foam on it so I just glue it together with this cute pearl now for this pink rosette I'm just gonna add a heart and some pink thread and just wrapping it around my fingers And then I'm going to use this gold ribbon I got from Hobby Lobby. I made a banner out of it. And just place that in the middle. And then this bow from Tim Holtz. And then a sequence in the middle. And that's how it looks. Now this purple one, I'm using this leftover square from a shaker I made. And I'm going to place a, a banner. Just cut the middle and then the corners. And that just goes right in the middle. This is from Target and I just cut a piece. And it's like three strings in one, so I just separated them. Did it the same thing, just made it um, like a like I did with the thread. And then I'm using these the word stickers from Hobby Lobby. Place it right in the middle too. And to finish it off, I'm gonna add a little tiny butterfly. And that's how it looks. Now the last one, I'm gonna add this circle scallop. Place it right in the middle. Make another banner. And then this Martha Stewart butterfly. And then another little butterfly in the middle. And then some sequins. So there's many ways you can embellish them just by using your leftover scraps. And, um,. I really enjoyed making this. I hope you guys like it too and give it a try and 
and share the video if you like it. Thanks for watching everyone. Bye.